need them, I have to take this motorcycle and uh Hube Samba coming in. <laughs> My favorite spot. Your favorite? <laughs> Cube lives Your right there in that spot? chair. I live here. He's he lives in that chair right there. What's yeah. this for? Uh, it's for sand. It's a sand pit. It's for speed. You ever played in the sand before? Speeding. Oh man! I mean, at the beach. Yeah, it's a sand pit for children. Uh, okay. Okay. Got a big ass child there. Oh yeah. Okay. Let's. Yeah. Where's Where's uh? What's his name, man? Joel. Sleeping. Joel Promo. I don't know. He was a. Uh, oh, he went out. Today. He went. I think he went out to go have sexy time with someone. Oh, okay. Sexy time. Shit. Sexy you want to time. Smoke? Last time we were uh, we, we were at Kaosan Road, mm -hmm. but yeah, then he got like drunk and shit, and then. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll do it. I'll, he was I'll with do it. Uh, the other Korean streamer. What's his name? Oh, Bro, this Korean. is all Hugh, by the way. What the fuck? Hugh has that? smoked hundreds of cigarettes in the week we've been here. Hundreds. That's all him. You smoke. You smoke weed? No. No, I don't smoke weed. It's, it's better than. Dude, spirits. yesterday, I swear to God, yesterday, I woke up at nine o'clock in the morning. He was out here smoking. What the fuck? And bro? then Why I you smoke at I night? went to sleep at eleven p.m. Every time I walked by the window here, he was out here. He was out here smoking 15 hours yesterday, straight. <laughs> he didn't. You. He didn't leave that chair for 15 <laughs> hours. Chain smoker, Hugh. Yeah, I, I, I swear. Live huh? I live here. He lives there. That's yeah. where he says he lives. My, that's the that's the spot. That's the fucking spot. It <laughs> was like, it was fucked. Like you're it's gonna that you're gonna get cancer, dude. No, no, no never. How many you smoke a day? I'm very healthy. I mean, this is my first one. Yeah, he doesn't smoke much. Sometimes. You, can't I just do it socially. Have you tried uh, uh, edibles here in Thailand? I don't smoke weed. Oh, okay. I don't, I don't like, smoke, but try it. No, no, I don't like getting high. Oh, okay. I, I don't I like I like stimulations. Stimulations. I don't like fucking I don't like weed high though. I I stopped because it used to it gave me a lot of anxiety. When weed I, is supposed to take away. No no. When I get really high, I get a very high anxiety. My yeah. my heart rate goes to like 150, 160. If you want to give me a beer, then I'll drink it. I don't smoke. Yeah, my bad. Thank you, bro. Okay. Later later. <laughs> later, he's trying to get me to smoke a cigarette. What I mean, you you probably do like a whole bunch of stuff, but I get like 160 beats per minute when I do weed. No, I haven't smoked weed in six years. That's the truth. And yeah. then when I went to, um, but you know what the main thing is? It's not just the anxiety. I can get past the anxiety with a little bit of Xanax. But the problem is, when I do weed, I don't do anything. I it smoke weed. On the strain. I well There's any a strain too. Any strain. Look. I smoke weed, and I swear to God, I do nothing for the rest of the day. I, even if I take one tiny hit of weed, I do nothing. I don't think. I don't do anything. I just sit down and I do nothing. I go on TikTok and I do nothing for the whole day. That's no good. That's no good. Well, as a content creator, it's no good. Do you think it should be legalized all over the world or what? I mean, sure. But, I mean, it makes everyone lazy, which means the people who don't smoke weed will be less lazy and then we'll have less competition in this world. You know what's really good, though? Stimulations. Because then I do stuff. Damn, stimulations. Fucking hell. Alcohol gets me stimulated. My career off based off doing nothing? No, I do a lot. I drink by since I started. Is that your first donation ever? You will find it interesting. I don't drink much. So since you're I telling me about your polygamous marriage? That's polygamous yeah. marriage? Yeah, I have a, a wife and, a, and we have a girl. How you have a wife? A wait, wife I need to ask you. Let me ask you a question. How did you convince? How did you convince your wife to do that? It wasn't me. It was my wife. It was my wife. What we, you mean? We were in a club, and then she goes, "Hey, man, there's this girl that likes you, but ask her if she she's down to do like a threesome." No then, way. Your I'm wife like, suggested I'll it. Call her later. I'll call her. Why did you, you well, meet her? Why does your wife want you to fuck other women? No, it's because <clears throat> you know the hip hop world, right? You, you fuck hella bitches and shit. So I was trying to be a changed man. So he she goes, "What if?" We fucked this girl together. Are you down? And I thought she was playing. Is she, a, is she like a bisexual? Not really, but she's also into girls. So. When she said, go talk to that girl and ask her if she's down to like, let's fuck. So I'm like, shit, are you serious? She goes, I'm not going to ask you again. Take it or leave it. So I was like, what the fuck? Let's go. And then ever mm -hmm. since, the, she's been living with us now. Like we're together five years already. So who's hotter, your wife or your girlfriend? They're both hot. But who's hotter? I know you have an opinion. They're both hot. Oh, no, I have a wife, and then we have a girl. Okay, so... so it's always got to be the wife. So the, the wife is your priority. The girlfriend is just like a fuck toy. No, hell no. Come on, no, no, no. 
that's that's a wrong way of putting it. No, we we, we all uh, we all love each other, man. That's them. So that's the wife, right side. Yeah, that's the wife. That's the girl. Girl. Wife. Anne and, and Marie. And what's the age difference here? Here, look. That's my wife here, and then that's my. Girlfriend. Oh, you have a girl, uh, kids too? Me? I have kids? Yeah, four kids. Four kids? Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Why? I have one child I had when I was in Africa, Namibia, when I was 14. You were in Africa too? Namibia, yes. Nami- Namibia? So you, Africa. Wait, you have an African child too? She was white though, like the mom was No, I know, but you have a child in Africa? She's here now. She's I know, in, and not here, in Philippines. Uh, Philippines. She came to the Philippines. So you, uh, you need see why do, no no it's okay. Why why do you have four kids? From four different women, man. Different I, women? My first girl in Namibia, one child, and then here in the Philippines and in the Philippines I have two. And then um Wait, you had a kid at fourteen? Yeah. I don't know why. Why the fuck why? Because it was an era oh thanks bro. It was an era where I hadn't I I didn't know anything about sex. There was no internet during the like the night. Then you poop stain for the sub. <laughs> What a name. Uh, but yeah, man, but I didn't know anything about sex. So I didn't know what was semen. I didn't know none of that. You were just busting inside the chicks? I busted inside the chick and I told her, I'm like, shit, my daughter's going to be fucking cracking up with this shit. They're watching. My eldest daughter. And I, t- I said, by the way, my baby, you're not a mistake. Wait, how old is your kid that you had at 14 now? No, one now, she's 28. She's 28? Yeah, she's 28. Hmm. So my, my eldest daughter is 28. My... Hmm. That's the same age as me. You could be my father. Is it? Like, kind of. My our girlfriend is. My you're, wife is. Wait, how old are you? Forty-four. Hmm. Forty-four. You're forty-four. You're no way. I thought you were like thirty. You're forty-four, dude. Like forty-four. Oh, bro, this dude's forty-four. Ice is gaslighting me here, man. Yo, dude, that's no wild, bro. Way. That's fucking insane. My 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 girl, uh, my wife is forty. Our girlfriend is as old as you. Mm. Wait, can I see the twenty-eight-year-old? You got a photo? When you were younger and like a child, what did you aspire to be growing up? What age? So it depends. Like when you were like 14, what did you want to be when you were older? 14? I wanted to be a rapper already. So your whole life, that's what you've been working that's towards? What, that's I've been, I've been doing music. It's just. And what's the goal here? You want to be like super world famous type shit? Nah, I just want to be able to provide for my family, man. That's it. Are you able to using rap? Not really. I mean, kind of, but then that's why I'm doing this. So you have a job in the Philippines? No job. So how do you I've been how do you afford rap. four kids? My wife works. So your wife pays for all the children? No, no, no. We share. We share. Where's Anne? I want to introduce you to Ice real quick. Where's Anne? This is this is um, our girlfriend Marie. Say hello. Say hello to uh, Ice Poseidon. Yeah. Yo, what's up? Where's Anne? Um, she's working and I'm still at, um, at the office. Oh, she's working. Shit. So- Mommy, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Ma. Sorry. So- my wife's working at the house. Like, a, a call center shit. No, that's all right. Nice to meet you. Yeah. I said Hugh. Oh, Hugh, right here. Sexy. Look, his fucking belly. Oh, there you are. Hello. Oh, that's my wife here. <laughs> mommy, Mommy, say hello to <laughs> Paul real quick. I'm girlfriend. <laughs> Same time. Hi, Paul. Thank you. Do you guys have threesomes the other? <laughs> of course we do. Yes. <laughs> what the hell? Wow, that's interesting. Thank you. And it was your idea, huh? No, that you. Thank you. Yes, but bye. So who? Hey, good boy, that's fine. I allow him to do anything that he wants. So who found the girlfriend? Was it him or you? Both of us. On what, like Tinder or something? No, in a club. In a club? Yeah, I was doing a show, and so our girl was like a fan. (laughs) You're a fan? They were both fans, man, both of them. She was a fan. I'm so proud. So you don't, so you don't care that he has a wife? Damn, you're being pressed now. (laughs) You're being pressed. Oh my god. It's just, it's just interesting to me. My ladies are being pressed. Uh, Yeah, you don't have to hide anything. Fuck it, man. Like, don't hide anything. 
You guys okay? No. Oh my god. Smile to the camera. I get it now. I get it. I get it. You, wait a sec. He has two. You're a fucking Chad. Alpha Chad. He, he has two women. And they pay for the children and you don't do shit. <laughs> no, I no, get no. it. You're a fucking Chad, bro. No. I get it. They both. You have two women making you money. Not one. No. She supports her family. My girl, my girl supports her family, man. So are you going to also have a child with the girlfriend? Depends on her. She's too young. Um, How old is she? I don't, but right now, I don't want to. Wait, you're 28? Yeah. Same age as you. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> but he's 40. He's 44. You know he's 44, right? You don't care? That's like, you. that's cool with you? Age is nothing but the number. Age Come on, man. It doesn't matter, you know. Oh, there you go. Thank you. Thank you, God. Oh, my uh, It's a genuine love. Love? Damn. Uh -huh. You're busting out some love talk. Come on. Is it know. really love? Damn. All right. I mean, shit. All right. Well, fuck. Sick it. Bye-bye. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. So, uh, I know. Okay, love you too. I Make mean, sure there's no sense in hiding shit, man. I love you. Oh, he said he love you too. Hi, you. Hi, you. Hello, hello. Wait okay. a sec. Bye, 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 now. Bye, bye. I love Yo, you. What's up? So your your girlfriend's 28, uh, but your daughter's also 28. <laughs> Is, you don't think that's kind of crazy? No, it's it's love, man. Uh, they're uh, they're above age already. At least it, no, um, I know they're above age. At it, least it's not in pedophile shit. No, man, I but. get it, but you don't think it's like like your daughter's the same age as your girlfriend? Your daughter is a 28. Yeah, my eldest daughter. Really? Yeah. <laughs> same as you. But my my daughter is a she's a lesbian. She has a, a, a girlfriend oh, really? in the Philippines. Yes. Oh, that's really cool. My my our girlfriend's as old as him. Yeah, <laughs> it's very interesting. That's that's interesting. That's great. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> I mean, that's cool, yeah. I mean, polyamorous is really interesting relationships. It's not legal in my country, by the way. Mm. Not legal? Yeah, like, you know, it's, Philippines is a Christian country. They, do, they don't allow polygamous relationships. Well, I mean, you know, we're live. Right. And you're saying this on live stream. Right. But still, like, I don't really care. It like, doesn't really... For me, listen, man. What happens if, what, well, you go to jail or something? No, no, no. It's not that. It's, it's just, already 10 years past. So yeah, but, they but really my, this is my thing with religion, man. I don't want to get into fucking religion talk, man. Like, I grew up in a in a Catholic Christian family, oh, but yeah. I'm not in it like like that, like that. I just believe in doing good, and then you good will come back as long as you do good. That's it, man. It's pure goodness, love. That's it. Is that a black cigarette? What is that? Blueberry and chocolate. Chocolate cigarettes? Dude, I gotta try this. Scuff yeah. Gaming. Thank it's you for the sub, Scuff Gaming. Thank uh, you. I've never had... What kind of fucking... A chocolate cigarette? Wow. I think it's a come from USA. Chocolate. D no, it's cigarette. illegal in the USA. You can't flavor cigarettes. Yeah. You buy that here? Yeah. How on much the, is on that? The street. I don't remember. Oh, shit. Okay. You wanna try it? No, 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 no. I'm cool. Man, I tried brownies here. That's the last time. That I is not good. Shit. That is weird. It tastes would, like a black and mild. I don't smoke cigarettes, but I wouldn't, I would not know, like, how would that taste like. But no, that's, good. that's, that's, in, what a, you're, you got an interesting life, you know that? <laughs> that interesting. But I do wonder, it's I mean. It's not easy, too. Because, you know, I, I mean, okay, I, I have a question. I mean, I hope I, this doesn't offend you. Go, go, go. But. Auburn Merlin took $3.33. Yo, eyes. This guy is better than sus. He doesn't hide his wife and girlfriend from you. Get him a shot on the bus. I I do, uh, so, hmm. I feel like by the time I'm 44 years old, uh, you know, you're getting old. You're you're almost right. 50. Right. And I feel like most people retire when they're 60. And retire from? Like, oh, how, how do you plan on retiring when you're too old to do anything? That's why I train. Like, I... I do jam, martial arts, all of that, just to keep me young. Because if, if not, then I won't be able to party. Like. So you're just you're just gonna work until you're ninety. Work and travel and. I mean, you can't call it work when you're loving what you're doing. Like this, I'm loving this. The hip hop, the IRL. Not true. No, people retire when they're like sixty in the U.S. Yeah, mm. that's pretty normal because they have a four hundred one k, whatever. You work for forty years and you retire. Mm. That's like a typical thing. Right. And I feel like if I'm 60 and I'm still having to work, like I feel like I won't be able to because I'll be too old. 
But this, you consider this work? This, what you're doing? I mean, you think I'm doing this at 60 fucking years old? There's no way I could do this at 60 years old, bro. I, I probably will have no energy at 60 and have arthritis. Arthritis? Or cancer or something. Fucking arthritis. Oh, my God. Yeah, man. Oh, well. It is what it is, man. Shit. Like, what's your goal with streaming here? Um, Just to, for the next maybe few years, just to grow on my own. And, and then be like the... Face of kick in the Philippines. And if it works out, you want to quit? You quit rap? Not quit. <clears throat> do do it together. I want to bring. Because this is guy. His name's E B Z. He's also forty four years old. Is it? And buddy, and he's a rapper and streamer, mm -hmm. but he prioritizes his rap instead of his streaming, and that is screwing him over. I've seen the because he's song. not that good of a rapper. I've seen the one song where you were in there. Elfie yeah. Said two dollars. Zeus can come on the bus. The, 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 girl, the purple army song. Yeah. That he one. does about his almost ten kids and ten wives. Get slay on the bus. He content. Is this? Do you also slap people? Who are you asking them? No, you. Do you slap people? I only slap if they have something against me. <laughs> I don't. I don't really slap. Like not unless they <laughs> slap first, then I'll clap back. Hmm. You know, I only clap back. You a signed artist, man. Tell them. <clears throat> Interesting. Is this okay? Like, or do I need to pull that down? What? The sound. No, it's good. You're good, bro. That's interesting. Okay. No, I just, I think it's so interesting because there's a lot of, you know, recently I've, I've been streaming with a lot of like 40, 50 year olds and it's, it, 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 it's all very, it's all very interesting to me because, you know, I, it's just very, you're a lot older than me. That's all. You got 20 years on me nearly. Wait, wait. Almost, yeah, I have 24 years on me. No, not 24. Like, maybe... No, 16. 14. 14 years. 14, yeah. That's, I mean, that's pretty... When did oh, you no, have... 16, you're right. 16. When did you have your second kid? 17. What is wrong with you, man? I don't know, it's just horny. And how did you... I'm just fucking horny, how, man. Come did, on, son. And how did you afford to take care of your child at 14 and 17? Rap. You oh, no, no, 14. No, no, they hid her from me. They hid my daughter from me. They erased that. They my, hid your daughter? Yes, because of uh, discrimination in Africa. Racial discrimination. I'm not white, so I grew up in the apartheid era. Where, like... Uh, You're not... What do you mean, in Africa? Because you weren't white? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they hid her from me. Like Apartheid. You heard of Mandela? What part of Africa was this? Southwest Africa. Namibia. This one. Namibia. Nam Namibia. Yeah. Namibia. Th that's not... That's South Africa? Southwest Africa. That's why they speak the same language. And so they hid her from me, and I met my daughter on Facebook when she was 16. Okay, so how did you find her? On Facebook. Eventually. No, no, no. The mother called me, like, her mother's old school. Her mother's, like, four years older than me. And she goes, yeah, I got your mother. I, I got your number from your dad, uh, from your father, and you have a daughter here in Africa, she wants to know who her father is, and that's it, we don't want to do anything with you. So I'm like, fuck, man, I have a daughter. What the fuck's her name? You didn't even know? No, I kind of knew, but... And she was being hidden from me. And so I searched her name on Facebook, wrote her there, apologized, and did our first video call on Facebook, and now she's with us in the Philippines. So after you had your second child, you knew about sex now, obviously. Obviously. Yeah, you kept having With kids. my second girl, I have two kids. But you kept having children. I mean, I don't know. This is a Filipino thing, man. Just have a lot of kids? No, but now... I In 24. America, four kids, you need to be a millionaire. I heard, I heard. Like, child support and all of that. I uh -huh. mean, that's the difference with Philippines. There's no, like... You're not forced to do, like, child support. It's up to you. Mm -hmm. You know, in America, when you have a child, you're forced to pay? Mm -hmm. No, you that's only if you leave your wife. Oh, okay. Well, oh. there, Philippines, is not like that. It's up to you. There's no child support. None, like... I mean, it's up to you. It's your conscience if you want to give like, mm -hmm. for your child. But I take care of all my kids. Like, they're all with me in one house. Oh, really? Yeah, every one of them is with me in the house. How we get to take care of each other, I have no fucking idea. What, do you have, like, ten people in your house? Eight. That's eight? Like eight, yeah, like, four of my kids, my niece, my what? brother's daughter lives with me. And this is a mansion, right? No, no, it's just an old-ass house. Like what? One day, you'll see. Se Seven-bedroom house? No, like a four-bedroom house. I sleep on the floor, like in the in the living room, mm -hmm. because all the rooms are filled with my kids. Mm -hmm. So the living room is our bedroom. Like we just we just put the we put the the mattress on the floor, and that's where we sleep. You're a good daddy. As long as we survive, man. As long as I survive, want the kids to school. That's it, man. That's it. 
I mean, that's interesting. That's all I do, man. I think if I had four kids, I would kill myself. <laughs> you don't have any kids yet. No plans. Look at him, look at him. Does it look like I have kids? I, I don't know. You might have fucked somebody and left your kids somewhere. I brought some random dollars said two dollars so I can take care of his family when I let you take targets little kids. Suspended his 14 year old girls wearing his pants. What is that, he fucking Mr. Krabs? Yeah. He is a modern release from that says you can be under each when he sells an injury. What the fuck was that, Mr. Krabs? Show your daughter. Oh, you want me to show my daughter? I still want to see, yeah. Uh... I mean, to be honest, though, that is wild, bro. That's, I mean, I could, I don't even want, I mean, when I'm like 40, I'll have one kid. Steve will do it, sent $3 ice beside and never mentally grew past the age of 14. Luckily, 80% of his viewers are 14, too. Oh. That's my eldest daughter. No, it's not. Yeah? No, That's your 28-year-old daughter? Yeah. She's tall, man, like, as tall as me. Can I see? Yeah, yeah, she's tall. Hmm. She's tall. And then my son, oh, my son, very famous in Philippines. Very, very fucking good rapper. Yeah. No, no, singer, R&B. Singer. Oh. Very, yeah, very, he's like six foot tall, taller than me. Oh. My son, my yeah. son is more famous than me. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Not bad. Cool. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, she's, this one, this one, this is my daughter, man. That one. Oh. So she's this, so yeah. pretty. She's tall, bro. She plays netball. She's a singer? No, no, no. No, she's yeah. She's an athlete. athlete. Eight, 28? 28, yeah. She's, she's an athlete, athlete, athlete. Man. Like, uh, She's a professional netball player. You Whoa. heard the netball? No. no netball, no. Netball. It's, it's basketball without the ring. It's like a British thing, man. Like, what is the sound? Bas basketball without the ring. No, that's that's interesting. Yeah, no, I mean, shit, man. That's crazy. Yeah. I, I, like I said, I'll have one kid and I'm like 35, 40, but that's it. Like, just one kid. All you want is one? A boy or a girl? Kids are too expensive, dude. That's That's my son. I mean, you can search through his... The left one? Yeah, the left one. You can search through the photos. He's famous. My son, hella famous. That dude, mad famous. Like a... Famous? Yeah, an R&B singer. Hey, hey. Well, we could have What the fuck was that? 11K followers. Oh, okay. Is that... That was yours? I yeah. 29. She 34. Sly came 44. That means Penguin is 62 and Homeless is gay. I mean, your kid is like a chat, bro. <laughs> yeah, you got good genetics. He's, he's a chat. This dude right your, here. Your daughter it looks nice. Your your son is a chad. All of them. All of them are. God bless. They're good, man. They all look good. Yeah, no, that's good, yeah, man. Damn. Good. Wait, wait, wait. Let me. Hey, hey. Right? Jake Chris. Let's, let's, let's show Ice Jake. Ice Chris. 29. Kill 34. Yeah, so I came I'm 28, actually. Not 29. He's a 28. I, I wonder if my kid will be a Chad. <laughs> I want a son. I'm gonna have the semen implanted with an egg. Semen implanted with a what the? Yeah, fuck? I'm not gonna have a. I'm not gonna have an, uh, a natural birth. Oh, okay. I want to have uh, the semen and the egg. I want to choose the egg, and I want to put the semen into the egg, like with. Uh, what do you mean? With science. Egg? Like in America, you have the, you have, there's this thing you can do. You can implant semen into an egg. Course, you can choose, semen. you can choose the what egg. your girls? You don't want to use her thing? Her... I ain't trying. Alvin's abandoned dog sent to oh. dollars so he takes care of his family when Alex addicted to Target's little kids. I, I, don't, I don't, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to have a, a natural birth. There's a malt release oh. this that you can be under until he sells long -term. So I want to do this thing where I take the egg out of her. And then I put the semen in the egg, and then we put the egg in like a thing, like a, it's in an, it's a, like an environment where the egg can grow, and then you put the baby inside of an incubator, and it, and then you can feed the baby through the incubator. Are you serious? That's expensive. Yeah, but I can choose what you know what kind of kid I want, male, female. Like I'm gonna choose a male egg. Ah, uh, okay. That's how you. That's how you get it. All right. And I want to guarantee I'm having a a, 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 a boy. Ah, I don't. I don't want a daughter. I want a boy. Why? Because I can't relate to having a daughter. What am I going to say to my daughter? Oh, you want a Barbie? Like what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? If it's a boy, I can grow him to be masculine. Aha, uh -huh. and be a Chad. You know, and be like a you know like a nice guy. I see. Okay, I get it. I get it. Okay. Uh, yeah. So in America, you can. It's like a thing you can do. Anonymous sent three dollars ice. Sly is a Chad. Maybe he can teach you how to be a man. First lesson, look at how you're sitting with your legs crossed like that. That's not what a man does. 
I'm sorry about the stuff. I'm sorry. Actually, I'm so masculine, I don't care if I cross my legs. It doesn't make me a feminine person. It makes me, like, I don't care, you know what I mean? Like, I'm a god, like, I'm a god bro, like, I'm a Chad, like, type shit. I think that's already legal, Chad. You can Yeah, I do want to play that. god with science. I'm an atheist, so I don't give a shit. I want a boy, and so I'm going to have a boy, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's... I mean, that's, that's, that's how, that's why there's so many children in the Philippines, because, like, lots of them... Because if I had a, imagine if I had a daughter, like, okay, no problem, and then I want, okay, let's have a boy now, and I have another daughter, okay, it's fine, whatever, let's have a boy, I have another daughter, I have three daughters, I'll kill myself. That's why there's so many kids in the Philippines, because a lot of them want boys, but they can't, can't and then, with your exact same reason. Exactly, so I want... I mean, if they could have that in the Philippines, too, is that what you call artificial insemination? That's what that is, right? Yeah, something like that, I don't know. And then you can choose. I just want to, yeah, I mean, it's whatever. Fuck Made it. with you? No, man. No, I mean, Hube, Hube, like, takes a shower in that thing. That thing's fucking gross now. <laughs> it's good. He, like, farts in it and shit. No, no, it's not. Your, your water is dark, Hube. No, I put the body, body wash. Yeah, he showers in the hot tub. It's fucking disgusting. Why? <laughs> it's body wash. Like, we have showers here, dude. No, it's a body wash. Yeah, you body wash in the hot tub and then leave the water in there to sit <laughs> no, for days. No, no, I take out, I, it's okay, but it's, it's clean. It's very clean. Really good. Oh, also, it's 100 degrees out here, and dude's going in a hot it's tub. It's, it's, a, it's a cold, cold. It's very cold. Oh, it's cold? It's cold. Oh, okay. So, it make a keep the water out, so it, it will cool down this area. It's it like a natural, the it's like a natural AC. It's very good. Yeah, you don't want to go in the water with him? I get in the water with him. It's very good. Huh? It's very good? Yeah. It's very good. I don't know, man. That water looks a little murky, bro. Yeah, you're you're an interesting oh, no. person. I put this. Oh. When I'm 40, I think I'm going to have, like, a suit on, like, like nice, like, whatever. You got pink hair. You got fucking tie-dye shirt. <laughs> like, you keep it young, bro. You keep yourself young. I, I'm young at heart. That's what that is, man. I mean, it's fucked, man. 44, that's just an age, bro. Come on, no? It's an age. Addicted. What is it with you guys and, and the sus, man? Come on now. So, Get in. so Get what in. do you think about streaming though? Since you've been, since you just got into it, what do you think about it? It's nice. Um, what do you like about it? Uh, being real. That's it, man. Just being real, man. Being real. Yeah, just being real. Just it's easier. It's easier than vlogging. Because vlogging, you've got to go to the computer, edit shit. This one, no more edit. Whatever is there, is there. Plus, you see? Mr. QB. What's oh. the goggles for? For just the... Uh, it's your, it's protect, your thing? Protect my eyes. Oh. It's very good. I'm not getting in that. Well, well, let me call Sam and see if he called us. Uh, and we'll see what the verdict is here on the van. Ah, uh, here we go. On you, if you, uh, if you go on the van, you know? JT sent two dollars. You might as well send JT two likes. No sir. Hello. So did you call Sus? Yeah, bro. The problem with Sus is he's in like a kratom cobra, so like he he, he won't wake up. Like he's probably in a kratom coma for like two days now. He wakes up at like seven o'clock every day. Well, so he wouldn't even be able to come with us anyways. He's taking fucking... He's in comas and shit non-stop. I mean, uh, yeah, I mean, bro, whatever you think, if, uh, if, 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 uh, Sly Kane is, is, is where the content's at, you know, I'm for it. You know, I even messaged Kiara Kitty. I even messaged Kiara Kitty and said... What'd you say? I even messaged Kara Kitty and said, look, I'll like, I'll let it be. I won't like beat you too hard if you want to come on the trip. And then she was like, I've already gone to, I've already gone back to Singapore, but thanks. She said she would meet us in Phuket. For fuck's sake. All right, well, I mean, it's... I mean, it was, it was like one of them things where you DM someone and you hope they say they're not going to go, but you do it just to be nice. It was one of them. To be honest, <laughs> this is what I, this is what I think. I think Sus is, you know, got his other priorities going on right now with the, with the kratom. So let's give, yeah. I, I'm going to give Sly Kane a shot here, and I think he can be the content enhancer. 
Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know him well enough if you think... He kind of, you know, he, he kind of reminds me of Suspendus if he was more responsible. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Uh, but we'll see, we'll see. Because if Sly Kane, it, if you don't get any clips at all on this road trip, then never again. Then never again. And then you should quit streaming. Agreed. I mean, it's been. In, I'm gonna. I'm gonna call shotgun on one of them front seats then now because this this bitch is filling up quickly. Well, I'm gonna. I get my. Cho I get to choose first since I'm paying for it, and then. Content lord. Yeah. And then you can have whatever you want after that. Yeah. Yeah. I'll take. I'll take AC on the front row. Well, the whole van is AC, right? Yeah. No, but. Yeah, 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 whatever. No, whatever, hold on, bro. Sam. You gotta tell me now. Does yeah. the van have fucking air conditioning or not? I'm trusting your judgment right now. I guess so. So this is what he said. He said, I drive when I want to drive. And also, I'm gonna smash the back windows. So the hot air just comes in constantly. No, dude, I'm serious. Oh, also, also, the back rear tire's been running a little flat recently, so we'll see how that goes. I'm serious, dude, I'm serious. I'm trusting your judgment on this van right now. Because here's the chat. I was either going to get a $5,000 Mercedes Sprinter from a professional limo company, or Sam found a guy who owns a van for $800. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For $800. The, 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 my in my defense, the, the professional limo company with the Mercedes is just going to be like, they're gonna be. They're gonna cut content. That was my thought process. So that's why I was like, "Look, we we get one." You know what else? You know what? You, you know what else would cut content if this van has no air conditioning? It does. He said it runs really cool. He said it runs so cold. That's what he said. Exact words. That sounds like some bullshit to me. We'll see tomorrow morning. If he picks me up and it's not icy cold in there, I'll tell him. Paul ain't gonna like this. If I get in the van and it's hot, I'm gonna say, all right, buddy, I'm going to the Mercedes Sprinter. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I'm serious. I'm not, I'm, I'm gonna yeah, refuse yeah, yeah, service yeah. if it's not fucking, you better hope it's freezing cold and it pulls up to the house. <laughs> yeah, 60 freezy. No, I'm serious, bro. There's gonna be six of us in the car. Eh? It's gotta be cold. Yeah, bro, it's gonna be 60 freezy. Fuck, I didn't bring a hoodie and you like that shit so cold. Wait, can you... This guy speaks English, right? Can I call this guy? Yeah, he speaks English, but I, I'm not going to have you ruin it for us before we've even met him. Let's just speak to him tomorrow. How am I going to ruin it? I just want to make sure it's air conditioning. You're going to call up... He, bro, I'll send you the screenshots. What? I mean, what? I can't talk to this guy? Bro, you're gonna go all autistic on him and he's gonna be like, what the fuck is this? Like, these guys are messing around, he's not gonna turn up. Like, just you, he's gonna be there tomorrow. Have your stream on and ready to go, and let's see what happens. Oh my god. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow. 60 freezy, I'll be ready. All right. I mean, I'm trusting. I'm trusting his word, chat. I'm trusting his word. It's this shit better not get like a flat tire an hour into the fucking road trip. Oh, that's fucked up. It's refundable. Don't say non-refundable. No fucking way. Do you guys trust his word, or do you think it's gonna be retarded, like some retarded ass shit? Refunded. Eight hundred dollars. Sounds fucking. It sounds fucking scuffed, bro. Eight hundred dollar van. For two weeks with a driver. Yeah, How can he afford to drive us for two weeks for eight hundred dollars? Yeah, it'll be funny until we get a flat tire and it's stuck in a place for three hours. Isn't the lobby of the hotel? You know how far that place is? It's oh, 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 oh. You good? Careful, man. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I mean, let me show you the photo differences here. This is the Mercedes van for five thousand dollars for two weeks. Looks looks really nice, right? Four thousand baht. In baht, how much is? And then here's the eight hundred dollar van. It looks pretty good still, but I don't know. Something about it seems fucking scuffed. It's refundable. There's no way that's not refundable. We just booked it today. 
please refund it. 3,000 baht is still 3,000 baht. Stop fucking playing. Refund it. Don't say you're going to give it away to somebody. No, 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 no. I don't know. There's something about the photos that seems scuffed. I don't uh, know. Stop fucking playing. We, we're not fucking balling out of control. But we'll wait till I see it. Fucking 3,000. Please. No, I really don't want to pay 4K. It's kind of a, or 5K. It's a lot. What are you doing? Refunding okay. something? The hotel I paid for like four days in Pattaya. Uh, you're going How to much Pattaya. did you sell your studio for? Uh, in pesos for like. I mean, it's the speakers, the microphone, and uh, and the interface. So ninety thousand pesos. So that's wait, wait, ninety thousand pesos is how much? Pesos. Yeah. Um, wait, wait, wait. Divided, divided by fifty-four dollars. One thousand six hundred seventy dollars. Your that's studio is only sixteen hundred. I mean, that's that's a lot for us. What, is it like a room? Yeah, it's like... Or it's, you just sold the equipment? Equipment, not the entire thing, just the equipment. But I mean, without the equipment, then you can't record. Okay, 1600 for like the mixer and everything? Yeah, the, the interface, the microphone, and the speakers. I mean, the computer is there. The, com the studio computer now is what I use to stream. Are you rich in the Philippines? Oh, hell. You'll see when you get there. Hell. Not me. I'm not rich. If I was rich, I wouldn't be wasting time streaming and... Doing all so you it. don't so you don't like streaming? No, I do. It's just for the money. No, it's not. I do. Two thousand dollars? No, it's not two thousand. A thousand six six hundred, not two thousand. Well, if you said you enjoyed streaming, so if you had money, it shouldn't matter, right? No, I mean, if I was if I was to choose, if I had money, I would do like business and shit, like real estate, passive income. But that's no fun. Streaming's fun. I mean, streaming is fun, and then I wouldn't have to worry about you know making money and just enjoy streaming yeah. like look for the past for the past three months i was just enjoying just with like how many viewers that i had how the, the fuck did you go to africa at 14 if you're not rich my parents were united nations teachers so they were they brought there for free we our living was for free education was free and then bringing the children they're free United Nations. And then they UN? Died. UN? UN. Ah, yeah. oh, your parents were working for UN. Yeah, they taught oh. music and English. Oh, I mean, that's pretty... Tribes. That English to the tribes. tribes. Africans can speak way better... Like, the tribal people speak way better English than, mm. than like, locals here. Mm. I mean, that's pretty surprised. good. That's that's cool, though. You got to go to Africa and everything. I studied with the Bushmen. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I studied with them, like that's with really the Bush people. Yeah, you cool. heard of uh, fuck? That's gonna make me. What is that? Old. Like a tribe or something? Like tribes. I studied with them. I've even I even experienced a tribe where they cut the clitoris of the women. You heard of this? Don't they do that everywhere? Don't they? No, not with women. They they, they cut the skin sometime of the, to circumcise the boys, right? But for lady. But yeah, yeah, and then there's a tribe in Africa. They they circumcise your your clit. Oh. So that you become a woman, and if you cry. If you show emotion that you cry, they, see the, the family today. will disown you. I tried. They said oh, the band's no. busy. Yeah. They That's, disown you. It's crazy, right? It's crazy culture. The fucking clip, man. I mean, oh. they, they're like tribes. They don't know shit. You know what I mean? That's their thing. So. Imagine being a fucking tribe, dude. Like, what the hell? He's all this, all this like, nice technology in the world, and you're a fucking, you're a fucking tribe? Like, dude. That's... that's have, you, have you heard of the movie Guts Must Be Crazy? No. Damn, I'm old like a motherfucker. You never heard of that? No. Oh, my God. Old man syndrome, baby. Gods must be crazy. Anyways, the, the leader there, Nick Sao, he was my... The cousin of my pastor. Yeah, water or something. 